Okay guys, today we're just going to be doing a whole lot of video pictures of people photo bombing and how to get rid of it, remove it. There are quite a few photos here, just photos off the internet that have got photo bombs and they don't want the photo bombs. So anyway guys, there's all these different types of procedures and techniques you can do depending on what type of Photoshop version you've got. Can do lots of things but at the moment. I'm using the Photoshop 2019 as you can see up here. Now, the beauty of this one is that you can do things like this. Uh, I'll just show you and then I'm just going to refer back to um, doing it the ordinary way, as in doesn't matter what version of Photoshop you got. Um, so, with this new one, we've got what they call content aware. What it does, it actually fills it for you. So it gives you a preview there. How do you turn? That's what the new version of Photoshop does. So, what we're going to do, we're not going to do that today. Today, we're just going to do all the older versions of Photoshop and how to actually fix up things like this with the new one. So, we're going to do that today. The best way, using the clone tool, is to just go to the new one. Just go to the new one. Just go to the new one. We're going to do, we're going to clone down the bottom here. Just see here. I'm just going to clone this section, move it across, and start to paint it in. As you can see here, the whole wave business here is not matching up. But that's okay. Go back to the other side, do the same thing. When you're doing cloning, it's it's pretty easy to stop up. Um, I'll show you for the six minutes. If I can see them right in here, I'll show you them in general. If you find something to it, might be a little easy one. Huh? So if I go onto an area like this and I click, I'll do the option for it. And I'll give you an idea of the source. Now, as you move it along, you can see the cursor, it's, it's giving you a preview. So there's the things we're going to look at here. So what I'm going to do is going to do that here. And I'm just going to go and make where the lines looks like it. There. And it looks like it's an island behind it. The end of the island is what's see. Now what's happening there, I've gone too high. Let's see here. There, I've done that. So I'm just going to do the action. Oh, 
was different about the animals in the world as well. We do find it in the brain, we do find it in the brain. Going to go around the boat and we're going to get rid of the boat. Yeah. Let's pump in the way. See if that's gone. Didn't do a perfect job. Size. What's going to happen here? See here, one. Well, there were footsteps. Now yeah, they're going to multiply. So I can do that. So that's no problem at all. We can blend that in later on with another technique. I'll show you in a sec. Uh, to do all this photo shopping. To get rid of people's photo bombers. Good at this. So you can, you know, Copied and paste the section and made it a little bit so Now, this part up here where the ore is, all this area here. Plans down the tool, get the smaller one. Down there, down there. Down there, down there. Get down there. Let's see if it goes from there. That's good. Pretty good, pretty good, pretty good. Now, see here we've got three in a row. Basically what this is doing, it's doing pretty much the same as content aware. Right, I'm going to do this one this evening. Now we've got to change this. So we go this tool, which doesn't look realistic, does it? So we're going to get the touch tool, go around a certain area like that. So basically what this is doing is just taking a copy and morphing another area into this area. Oops. Yeah. 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 water here in the right. So here it's got bang, 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 all that. Let's do this, this tool. Let's move it over to Yeah. 
Oh, okay. So we're going to use what they call the patch tool. Look at that. Drag it up to there. And see, you see the color. Unless you keep on doing it. This, this is another way of doing this, but I don't know if people like it. I copy that. Copy. Paste. Copy. Copy. Cross. Bottom there with the arms and everything else we can raise and later on there's no problem. What we're trying to do here is make sure it's blue and make sure it's line. So we go to edit, transform, distort. You can go warp, but distort's fine. Like that. This is just all it is going to go to filter and the filter. Always black. Match. This is not the best way of doing it, but if you're not really happy with Photoshop and the way it all is, you can do it like that. Yeah, go okay, this way. I've got to do it yourself. If you need to see what it is, the eye makes it go out. If I'm not the photo, I'll do it straight. Yeah. Now, it's not all matching up properly. So, what we're going to do we're just going to flatten it. And there's a patch still. There's a section. Best way of making it blend in, or you can really brush to. But the problem is, you can brush to against that. Don't want that. Alright, we'll use the other one. Just to bring the roll in. What it's doing is also taking um, samples of areas on the left and on the right. What are you doing? It's actually doing it. Alright. Personally, I don't like doing it that way, but I like to do it. Alright. Now, this one, obviously, we're going to get a little dry in the background. But what we need to do is get, not, get a picture that's going to kick in there behind it. It's a lot easier. So, if I'm going to say, if we go here, Need some rocks, not too much because some of the little bits that we made there. I might go a bit wider. So we're going like this. Copy that and paste it. Paste it on the side. So that's a bit of 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 a bit we're just going to use the clone tool. Clone over his head. Paint, 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 paint. See how there's a bit of a different color there. It's because this guy is always changing. It's always 
And you look at the picture and you think, oh wow, that looks good. So you're always going back to the cleaning brush to get like this. It just blends it in a lot easier. That's all. So you would never know if it's a The helmet's going to be a little trickier. Yeah, and what we're going to do, we're going to do like this tree. The tree down here like this. And this one is a little time consuming, but I think it's a good idea. See what's happening with the wind climbing. Our source, we keep it down back to the same source, provide the tip of the Topping and topping, 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 and I just keep it like that. We keep it down back to the same source. And there's a healing brush or texture brush. I'm just doing a line and just morph it in a bit. That's a bit too. Now, one that will get copied. And then we to You get the idea of what's going on here. Uh, so this guy is now removed. And so is this guy. Okay. To the clone tool. I'm just going to set this here. Let's duplicate the road. Take this section here. Oh, not the rock section here. Oh, the distance of the road. Go down this. I don't know if it's going to be duplicated too much. This is there on the stairs. Oh, this is a big guy's arm. Alright, uh, this guy. Alright, uh, here we go. Okay, here we go. Part two. Alright, guys, now here we got this guy. Obviously, related, but we got a bull in Turkey. <laughs> That's it, <set. coughs> Okay, this procedure, what we're going to do, we're going to use the patch tool. Go right around his head, right around his body very closely to uh, all that is and the only reason this will possibly work I have to try to do it's not good near the right next to him which is good to get behind it what I'm going to do is here let's put the thing over in the first and go up and go down and check over there I'm going to go wrong like this Oh. Okay. 